Hello. I've just harvested so many peas. Look at the cats here. <laughs> so over there is strawberries. And uh, I just put this piece of wire over the strawberries so that um, the birds, the mouse birds, don't eat the strawberries. And there's another one over there. And um, the stuff is growing so nicely. All along the edge is butternut and sweet melon and kale. There's a sweet basil coming. <laughs> oh, I've also planted along this fence um, beans. How nice are they growing? So I want the beans to climb up along the fence. These are the potatoes in the tires. I'm going to put more tires on them. And I've got, oh, I've just harvested some amazing tomatoes. Um, so I've planted like another batch of tomatoes and then even a younger batch of tomatoes just so I can rotate. Because you don't want to have a whole pile of food, eat it all, and then have nothing. So. Here's the tomatoes. Just harvested the ripe ones. And um, <laughs> then a young batch of tomatoes, and an even younger batch of tomatoes. And then I'm going to plant some seeds now. And then these are the peas finishing over here. And we have some uh, green peppers coming. I will show you. So what I did with the green peppers. Um, oh, there's one. Is my friend told me about this. I didn't know, but I took off the flowers when the plant was still small because I didn't want. I didn't. It, it made the plant grow bigger, and then only when the plant was nice and big, I left it. Red sweet peppers as well, and <laughs> here's the peas. I got a big bowl of peas yesterday. It was amazing. So yeah, no, it's just amazing how you can grow your own food so quickly. I mean, it takes a bit of time and it takes a lot of effort, but it's beautiful. It's so fun and it's so rewarding and.